Was okay. it recording? Yeah. Okay, so we just went to Chick fil A. Wait, now or no? Okay, what was I gonna say? Okay, so we just went to Chick fil A and got a whole bunch of food. I keep looking at the screen, I'm sorry. Because we're doing a, how is it called? A mukbang. I call it a mukbang because I feel like that just sounds better, but apparently it's called a mook. What? Mukbang. Okay, so comment down below which one you say. <laughs> so yeah, we just went to Chick fil A and we're gonna be talking about like high school advice and like tips if you're going into high school mm -hmm. and just like stories we had in high school. So yeah. So I just got the waffle fries. This is like a peach tea lemonade. Let me see if it's good. I just got some sweet tea. This is so good. It tastes like Snapple. That's good. What did you get? I got um, a burger with a spicy like a chicken one. Chicken. Yeah, get in there. Get in there. Ooh, zoom oh, in. Is it? Ooh. Ooh, take that bun off. Oh, wait. <laughs> Flash yeah. on the bed. <laughs> We just got waffle fries. I guess it's just like a, a regular sandwich. Mm. It is a regular I'm sandwich. I'm just gonna put Chick fil A sauce on it. I'm gonna put pepper. So, what are we gonna talk about? We get some good sound effects. But it's kind of cold because we had to go places. Not really. Oh, so, wait, what do we should do a thumbnail. So we're going to be talking about some high school advice. Freshman year actually does count because later on when you're like going for scholarships, they see like your freshman grades. And if you got like a, like a bad grade in freshman year, then you're like out of all the scholarships. Mm -hmm. And like at first I was like, oh, whatever. I'll, what do you call like it? Like bounce back from it? Yeah. Like I'll be like, okay, I'll just do better next year. But it's like it counts every year and i didn't know that so yeah definitely realized. like start working on your gpa early on freshman year at the end when you only have like a couple of days like we're seniors when you only have a couple of days left you can't really change your gpa so that's one advice we have to give we used to do this we would stay after if we needed help that's really good because it's like the teacher only has to concentrate on one person and not like the whole class how to deal with fake friends the tea. Oh, I don't deal with them because you just don't deal with them. You just cut them <laughs> off. But in a nice way, you just don't answer them. I feel like when we first started high school, don't you think, like, I feel like I had more friends and then now senior year, I only have like a couple. Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like you don't have as many friends at the end. Yeah. You come in with new friends and come out with, with new friends. Different like friends. Like, I just met Funda in what, 11th grade? So it's like freshman year, I didn't even know who she was. Okay, so I asked some of my friends some high school advice that would be really helpful. And this is what she said. Make sure <laughs> you always have a charger with you. Yes. Because, because, no, no, this is a really funny story. So, um, let's say freshman and sophomore year, I can go throughout a whole school day with 100% battery, right? But recording. now I can't. It's not recording. Yes, it is. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Now I can't even go half the day without my charger. So um, but I would recommend a portable charger because oh, yeah. sometimes, sometimes you can't always have an outlet. Yeah, they won't let you. Really, really strict. She said, get out of your comfort zone and talk to new, she spelled new wrong, people instead of the same people you always talk to in class. So I guess make new to. friends if you want to. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You don't need friends. I'm just kidding. You need to get to school early because if you're like late a couple times, you literally get detention and have to stay after school just for like five minutes. Like that's not worth it. And you get no parking spot. Yeah. If you drive. So then you might have to park outside, like not in the school and you might get a ticket. That happened to a lot of kids in our school. Is that the club one? The club. Spicy deluxe. Oh, deluxe. Um, bring snacks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's so sometimes useful. Sometimes lunch is so late and it's like, yeah, you we, don't want to be that person that always asks people for food. Yeah, because they're, no, people they're, don't they share wanna, Yes, they want No one shares food. Like, food in school is like worth so much <laughs> than outside of school. <laughs> oh, yes. Sound effect. What other high school things do we do? Um, so there's so many scholarships that like will give you money for like having perfect attendance and like getting good grades. So like don't miss out, just get like your doctor's notes and stuff. 
I mean, I didn't really do that in high school. Like, I was actually absent a lot, but... I was that girl that was in school every day. Mm-hmm. She had perfect attendance. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. So, I think for drama, we just say stay out of drama. Like, no one really cares. And don't report flights, because you ain't, you ain't shit yeah, until like, you get in trouble. Yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> no one cares about little high school fights. Like, that's so immature. Like, no one watches that. Like, you know? Mm-hmm. At one point, it's like, oh, I did want to record fights, you know, like that thought. But I knew I was in trouble. But now, like, that we're done high school and we we'll look at other people recording like, fights, I'm just like, that was so stupid. Like, And, like, they would fight about drama. the dumbest things. Like, it wasn't even, like, cool or funny or, like, mm -hmm. worth fighting about. I'm tired of eating. Hmm. This is, like, too sweet. Okay, another one that I should have done was take the SAT, like, multiple times. I waited. But I feel like I could have got higher if I would have taken it more times. I literally only took it one time, so. I took it twice, but it wasn't much of a difference. Did, did you do better on the second time? I feel like just taking it as many times yeah. as you can. So, like, don't disrespect your teacher because, like, no one thinks that's cool. Like, literally, they're just there to do their job. So, if you get on their good side, they'll, like, help you. And if you need, like, a point, like, if you're really close to like a B, they'll probably give you a point if you're like a good student. So or, don't be, yeah. Say like you need recommendations letter and they'll help you with that. So don't hate your high school teachers. And if you do, just don't show it. <laughs> yeah, just like try to hide it, honestly. Like favorite high school memories. I would have to say senior year was my best year. Like that was the most fun, don't you think? We went like project graduation. That was so fun. Dave uh, Busters. I, have, I will have a vlog on it. So I have a <laughs> vlog on that. Um, what else did I like in high school? I didn't really like high school, to be honest. I feel like, um, especially freshman year, you should definitely try out. Oh, yeah. Say if you're like, okay, it, it doesn't seem that bad, or like, okay, I'll see, or I'm kind of interested, just do it, because you actually might like it, you might meet some new friends, and it's just fun. And something to do. Oh, a small group is better than a big, a big group. group. Yes. Oh my god. Because- No offense. I know this girl. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. So there's this girl in my school. She's literally friends with everybody. Like, she probably has streaks with everybody. <laughs> know people from other school and yes. call them best friends and everything. But honestly, at the end of the day, there's no one that's gonna have your back besides that few mm -hmm. group of people. So just stick with a few people. And if you're friends with like a huge group, there's always gonna be people like gonna be talking behind your back and like just like negative stuff that you don't really need. And being popular. What even Not is that? Even. There's no point in that. You're never gonna see them again after high school, so. Boys. Okay, boys. <laughs> okay, so look, this is what happens in high school. Like, they'll just like talk to you on social media, but when you see them in person, they won't say a word. No, right. <laughs> they don't know you probably. Um, um, I say don't waste your time talking to them. They just move from one to the next. Like, like our, my friend group, like, there would be one person that would DM me, and they would DM, like, the friend the exact same thing, as if we don't talk and, like, tell each other. Like, what? Mm -hmm. Oh, sometimes you just be like... Oh, like, sometimes you make a friend zone. <laughs> Kaylin was saying, be careful what you post. Be careful what you post on Twitter, because we, like, this happened a lot of times. People would say stuff on Twitter, and it would literally, like, turn into a whole fight. And, like, say they wouldn't even be talking about that person. Oh, don't be intimidated by people. Like, don't look up to these people that are popular. Like, don't be afraid of them or, like, you know what I mean? Like, you feel like they're better than you because they're really not. Like, they're probably the driest people ever. <laughs> um, okay, do you have any shady high school situations? Just don't talk about people because... Even if you have something... Yeah, even if you have, say something nice, they're gonna like hear something else and then think you said something else because that happened to me. So it says, what grade are you in? We're not in high school anymore. We just graduated. That's a 215. <laughs> What's your favorite subject? I've been like history. I was just gonna say history. Because it's more. Yeah, because we had a really good teacher that made it like so fun. She just made the story so interesting. <laughs> what clique or group are we in? Like the mini ones. The mini one? Nonchalant. Yeah, like we weren't really like a clique, I guess. We didn't do things as a clique. Um, what subject do you hate the most and why? Okay. Science. I, yeah, I didn't like science. I didn't really like math, to be honest. I didn't really like math. I kind of found it hard. I mean, I hated gym. Gym was fun sometimes. I just did not like playing softball. It says, describe what you wear to school. 
Okay, it changes. So, what are you talking about? So in the beginning of high school, I would like try to dress so nice. I, okay, can I yeah. tell you about Thanks. Madeline? All right, especially junior just year. Madeline would never wear like hoodies, sweatpants. Or like, like this is what she wore every day. Okay, like a typical every day. Mm -hmm. She wear jeans with like what's called combat boots, mm -hmm. with the lace up things. Yes, yeah, sweatery, knitty, long sleeve, whatever. With a scarf. <laughs> Literally, her outfit every day. It would be, but it would be like a different print. And I'm just like, yo, you don't get tired of that. Like, why don't you wear sweatpants? <laughs> She's like, this is cute. I'm like, okay, well. Yeah, and I remember I would be so uncomfortable. But I was like, this is cute. So senior year came around, and I literally would I, wear leggings. Yeah, and I, I never saw her wear like that nice until stuff. senior year. Yeah. I just bum it to school like senior year. I just want to be comfortable. You tell me what I will wear. Okay, so Caitlin would be wearing them lacrosse shirts. A, a typical outfit. Okay, what's a typical Caitlin outfit? American Eagle. Something for American Eagle. Okay, well describe what I will I wear. I don't know. This is what I'll wear. I don't know. I will probably wear like a t-shirt, like a v-neck t-shirt. This question is, um, have you ever been a teacher's pet? No. I think I have. Like me and my friend Lauren, would like go out of our way to like stay after school with this teacher and just like try to be nice to them. Wait, so I get, I, yeah, I guess that's a teacher's pet. What's your favorite school meal? <laughs> well, okay, I, 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 I have one. You go first. Okay, it's like this. please don't say the same one as me. Keep going. It's like they call it pizza rolls, but it's like oh, yeah. it's spicy. Okay, yeah. so it's basically a mozzarella stick, yeah. but breaded and it has. Sauce Spice, in like it. buffalo sauce. Okay, those this, are my favorite. This is my favorite school lunch. Like it's gross, but this was my favorite one. The mashed potato bowl with the popcorn chicken, the corn, the gravy, and like it the is cheese. Weird, but it's and all mixed together tastes so good. It's like KFC. Have you ever ditched school? Like gone to school and then left? Mm -hmm. I mean, I had early release, but relate. that doesn't count. I mean, I'll purposely not go to school to go to the beach. I've never done that. Like, because you have a certain amount of days that you can skip. Like, you have, like, 10 or something. So, we were just use them up and just, like... Have you ever been in detention and why? Like, high school or, like... Mm -mm. Okay, I have, but not high school. Elementary school story. Yeah, same. I had detention because... Um, I was passing notes, okay? And I had detention quite a bit. Like, I was pretty bad. <laughs> so, I was, like, passing notes. And you know how in elementary school you're just, like... You're not supposed to, I guess? Yeah. And I just did. Okay, I only got in trouble for not getting my agenda signed. Like, that was the lamest thing ever. That is so lame. What do you like most about your school? What did we like most about our school? I think the teachers were kind of lit. Like, they were really nice, I think. There were some really cool teachers. Mm -hmm. But what else? There wasn't I mean, that many kids. I think our school is pretty spirited. Mm -hmm. What do you hate most about your school? Okay, all the rules. Obviously the people. Mm -hmm. The rules are so They were so strict. Stupid. We couldn't even have senior prank. Oh, oh, mm. dress codes, bro. Get over it. Yeah, you see shoulders. Who was your favorite teacher? I really didn't have any favorites. Give your best advice on surviving high school. Stay humble. <laughs> okay, so that was it for our high school advice. Hopefully, you like found it entertaining or like relatable, or you got something from it. Give this video a big thumbs up. If we you like likes. It. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll come out with a whole bunch more videos. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.